Good morning from somewhere in the Arctic. We're on the Dempster Highway and uh, Oddly enough, because of all the sunlight, we actually have nicer weather here than we would in Toronto or Ottawa. It's just kind of bizarre because you just get 24 hours of daylight. It's just nice and warm, beautiful, water's cold, sun is warm. It's a nice way to spend my day. I wouldn't have thought that this would be kind of like a beautiful summer spot up here in the Arctic, but it really, really is. And I don't know what people are talking about with the bugs because so far, since I got on the dumpster, I haven't had any bugs whatsoever. My windshield has stayed clear. No mosquitoes, had the windows open all night last night. It's beautiful. I don't know, so far so good. Let's hit the road and see what else there is to offer. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Arctic Circle. Yeah, <laughs> there's a little family of groundhogs living underneath it. After I don't know how many thousands of miles, I have made it to the Arctic Circle. And you know what? It wasn't even that hard. Like no drama at all getting up here. I'm really surprised to be honest. So uh, I think I might go a little bit further. I'd like to step foot in uh, the Northwest Territories. That's only another uh, 60 or so kilometers, so why not? Let's go to the Northwest Territories. And then we can turn around and uh, start making our way south. And I don't know, man, this is like my last big goal. So that's kind of like the end. It's the end of van life for now. I don't know, I'm kind of scared to let it go, to be honest. I didn't know what I was going to do when I got here, or if there's any kind of special thing to do, but uh, it's always just kind of sat in the distance as like the final goal, the final chapter of van life for me. And now I've reached it. I don't know. I mean, like, it's not done done, because we got to go back down to Vancouver and there's going to be loads of adventures between here and there, but this is this is really this is the end this is the end of pushing north this is this is big i guess i don't know i'm still very excited about stuff to come i'm very excited about motorcycle trips i'm very excited about going abroad and i'm very excited about sailboating so don't get me wrong there's going to be plenty of videos coming up but uh the old van willie the whale it's almost the end with her so i'm gonna miss her i miss that van it was a good van a really good van. All right, onwards and upwards to the Arctic.
that's it. This is the uh, Northwest Territories. This is the tundra. No trees in sight. Just me, Champ, the van, and that howling Arctic wind. And that's all. That's it. We're at Richardson's Pass right now. And I think this is as good a spot as any to turn around. So after this, it flattens out, turns into Arctic tundra, turns into the Mackenzie Delta, and then turns into the Arctic Ocean. And this time next year, you'll be able to actually drive to the Arctic Ocean. So I'm gonna leave that one up to one of you guys. Drive up to the Arctic Ocean, send me a link of your videos, I'll watch that stuff. Unfortunately, I'm about a year or two early. And all I can get up to is Inuvik, which is a small town and you know, it'd be a cool spot to step foot in, but uh, it's not the Arctic Ocean. So, ah, right on. That's it. That's it. That's all. I'm gonna start heading south. See the rest of British Columbia, the rest of Yukon. Ah, so much to see. Let's do this. So we made it. We've got a nice campsite just off the Dempster Highway. I got a nice dinner of spaghetti and uh, I'm watching a beautiful campfire, a glass of whiskey. I just wanna give a huge thank you to those of you who helped me along the way, either by hosting me, by helping me build out something in my van or fixing something, or uh, those of you who helped me on Patreon, or those of you who just watch, you know, thank you. Thank you for uh, pushing me to keep going. This is a big achievement for me, so uh, thanks a lot. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I'm just gonna enjoy this 24 hours of daylight, this never ending sunset. It's like 11 o'clock right now. I'm being blinded by it. And then, uh, yeah, maybe I'll finally get to sleep eventually. To another day in the Arctic.